the cities who come to his baptism, he said unto them, O generation of vipers, who hath warned you to flee from the wrath to come? Bring forth therefore fruit, meet the repentance, meet for repentance, and think not to say within yourselves, We have Abraham our father. For I say unto you, that God is able to see, God is able of these stones to raise upon children into Abraham. And now also the axe is laid unto the root of these trees. Therefore, every tree which bringeth not forth good fruit is hewn down and cast into fire. I indeed baptize you with water unto repentance, but that but he that cometh after me is mightier than I, whose shoes I am not worthy to bear. He shall baptize you with the Holy Ghost and with fire. Well, I think perhaps maybe um, I think uh, I think three chapters uh, should be good enough, I suppose. Uh, that brings about 15 minutes of, uh, um, you know, I don't want to overdo it, you know. Uh, you know, I mean, uh, we'll carry this on um, tomorrow, perhaps. Um, um, I enjoyed reading that to you. And I hope you enjoyed listening. Um, I hope as the days pass and I continue to read uh, from the New Testament um, all the way through. And I chose the New Testament as opposed to the Old Testament because uh, we are living in the days of the New Testament. You know, um, the birth of Jesus and his life here on, on earth um, and after death and everything... Uh, the New Testament uh, is what he, um, those are his laws. Those are, we live by the New Testament. Uh, we don't live by the Old Testament. And so, uh, anyway, um, on that note, uh, I'd like to close in a little prayer. And then you can go on about what you were doing. And so Father in heaven, thank you for this beautiful day, and, and thank you, Lord, for allowing me to, um, you know, for putting into my heart the idea to give this sort of broadcast, and, and Father, uh, thank you for helping me with my reading, um, even though I stumbled here and there. Thank you, Lord, for helping me with it. Uh, Father, I ask you to please bless those who are listening. Uh, and bless them in the troubles that they may be facing. And uh, and Lord, you know, you know who are you know those who are listening, and you know who, what their troubles are, Father. So please bless them, you know, and um, and bless those who are not feeling well, who are sick. Um, and thank you, thank you, Lord, for your blessings and uh, forgive us our sins and lead us from temptations thank you father for everything in jesus christ's name i pray amen okay um everyone i do hope you enjoyed this um please leave a message and let me know your thoughts um would you like to hear more Take care now. God bless.